Welcome, my brothers and sisters, to this our Mass on the 28th day of October, the Feast of St. Simon and Jude, Apostle. We begin, as always, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And also with you. As we prepare to celebrate the mystery of Christ's love, let us acknowledge our failure and ask the Lord for pardon and strength. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my, you know, my brothers and sisters, that I have sinned through my own fault in my thoughts, in my, thoughts and my words, in what, what I have, have done, done and what, what I have failed, failed to do. And, and I ask Blessed Mary, Blessed Mary, Mary of the Virgin, all, all the angels and saints, and you, and my you brothers, and brothers and sisters, to pray, to pray for, me, for me to the Lord our God. Through the authority granted by Jesus Christ to his apostles, I absolve you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Lord, have Amen. mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, Christ have, have mercy. mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Glory to God in the highest, and peace and to his people on earth. Lord God, Lord God heavenly, heavenly King, almighty God, God and Father, we worship you, you. we give we you thanks. thanks, we praise you for your glory. Lord, Lord Jesus, Jesus Christ, Christ only Son, Son of the Father, Lord God, Lord God, Lamb of God, Lamb of God. You take, take away, the, away sin the sin of the world. Of the world. Have, have mercy. mercy on us. You, you are seated at the right, at the right hand, hand of the Father. Receive, receive our prayer. prayer. For you alone, alone are the Holy One. You alone, 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 alone are the Lord. You alone, 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 alone are the Most High. Jesus Christ. Christ. With the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit. In the glory, the glory of God the Father. Of the Father. Amen. 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 Father, you revealed yourself to us through the preaching of your apostles, Simon and Jude. By their prayers, give your church continued growth and increase the number of those who believe in you. Grant this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Amen. We will now hear the first reading. A reading from the letter of St. Paul to the Ephesians. Brothers and sisters, you are no longer strangers and sojourners, but you are fellow citizens with the holy ones and members of the household of God, built upon the foundation of the apostles and prophets, with Christ Jesus himself as the capstone. Through him, the whole structure is held together and grows into a temple sacred in the Lord. In him, you also are being built together into a dwelling place of God in the spirit. The word of the Lord. Thank Thanks be to, God. to God. Our responsorial psalm is, their message goes out through all the earth. Their yeah, message yeah, goes yeah, out yeah, to yeah, all yeah, the yeah. earth. <clears throat> the heavens declare the glory of God and the firmament proclaims his handiwork. Day pours out the word today and night to night imparts knowledge. And our response, their message goes out to all the earth. Not a word nor a discourse whose voice is not heard. Through all the earth, their voice resounds and to the end of the world, their message. And we respond, their message goes out to all the earth. Alleluia, 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 alleluia. We praise you, O God, we acclaim you as Lord. The glorious company of apostles praise you. Alleluia, alleluia. This is the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Glory, Glory, Glory to, you, to you, O Lord. O Lord. Jesus went up to the mountain to pray, and he spent the night in prayer to God. When day came, 
he called his disciples to himself, and from them he chose twelve, whom he also named apostles. Simon, whom he named Peter, and his brother Andrew, James, John, Philip, Bartholomew, Matthew, Thomas, James, the son of Alphaeus, Simon, who was called a zealot, and Judas, the son of James, and Judas Iscariot, who became a traitor. This is the gospel of the Lord. Praise, Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Jesus went up to the mountain to pray, and he spent the night in prayer to God. My sisters and brothers, on this, the feast day of St. Simon and Jude, we read in our gospel that before choosing 12 apostles from among his larger group of disciples, whom he would later commission, to go out and preach the gospel. Before doing all of this, Jesus spent the night alone in prayer, which means that Jesus' selection of the twelve was a prayer event. How often in the gospels we find our Lord in prayer, and just as often he emerges from his prayer to heal, to bless, to teach, to forgive, and to serve, and to call to serve. This is a reminder to us as Jesus' followers of the importance of prayer in our own lives. As Catholics, we are gifted with a rich resource that supports our prayer life. There is the Divine Office, also called the Liturgy of the Hours, which is the daily prayer of the Universal Church, consisting of psalms, hymns, prayers, and other readings from the Scripture, and recited at various times of the day. We also have the Angelus, a brief devotion said three times a day that recounts the message of the Incarnation. And of course, we have the Rosary, perhaps one of the most popular forms of prayer in our Catholic faith. All of these are meant to bring us into the presence of God in a deliberate, thoughtful way to grow our relationship with God and to accustom us to thinking about that relationship on a regular, even daily basis. My sisters and brothers, whatever your current relationship with God is today, I encourage you to make use of these and other aids to developing and maintaining a daily prayer life. And please, start small. You don't have to say all of them at specified times every day. Maybe just add some part of one or more of these prayer resources to your day until it becomes part of your routine, until you find yourself thinking about and yearning for, and yes, maybe even missing God at these times. And remember, Jesus is still spending nights with God in prayer. And just like he prayed for his followers back then, he's praying for you now by name. Amen. Amen. Let us now proclaim our profession of faith. We believe in one God, the Father, the Almighty, maker of heaven and earth. Amen. Of all that is seen, seen, seen and unseen, seen. we believe in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only Son, of, Son God, of God, eternally, eternally God begotten God. of the Father, God from God, God light from light, true God, God, God from true God, begotten, begotten not made, one, one in being with the Father. 
Father. Through him all things remain. For us and for our and salvation. salvation. He came down from, came heaven. Down from heaven. By the power By the of the Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit he, he was born of the Virgin Mary, Mary and, and became man. For our sake, he was crucified under Pontius Pilate. He, he suffered, suffered and died, died, and was buried. On the, On the third, third day, day, he rose again, again in fulfillment of the scriptures. scriptures. He has sent him in the and is seated at the right, hand, right hand, hand of the Father. He will he come, come again, again in glory, in glory to judge, to judge the living and the dead, and his kingdom and the way. We believe in the Holy Spirit, Spirit the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father and the Son. With the Father and Father the Son, Son is worshiped and glorified. He has spoken, spoken through the cross. We believe in one holy, holy Catholic, and apostolic church. We acknowledge the baptism for the forgiveness of sin. And we look for the resurrection of the dead. And the life, life of the world to come. Amen. Amen. My brothers and sisters, we are gathered to celebrate the mystery of our salvation in Jesus Christ. Let us ask God, our Father, to open for all the world this fountain of life and blessing. Our response is, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear Lord, our prayer. Hear our prayer. <laughs> For all who have dedicated themselves to God, that God will help them to be faithful to their promise. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. <laughs> For peace among nations, that God may rid the world of violence, and let us serve God in freedom. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. <laughs> For the aged who suffer from loneliness and infirmity, that we will sustain them by our love. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For all of us gathered here and virtually, that God will teach us to use wisely the good things God has given us, that they will lead us closer to God and to the eternal blessings God promises. We pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our prayer. prayer. Father, hear the prayers of your people. Grant us what you have inspired us to ask you for in faith. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, I leave you peace. My peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church. And grant us the peace and unity of your kingdom, where you live forever and ever. Amen. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And, and also, also with, with you. you. Let us offer each other a sign of peace. And if you are with someone right now watching this Mass, please offer them a sign of peace. If you are alone, please bring them to your heart and mind and hold them in peace. 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 Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness we have this bread to offer, which earth has given and human hands have made. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed, Blessed be God forever. forever. By the mystery of this water and wine, may we come to share in the divinity of Christ, the humble himself in faith. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness, we have this wine to offer, 
fruit of the vine, and work of human hands, it will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God, Blessed be God forever. forever. Lord God, we ask you to receive us and be pleased with the sacrifice we offer you with humble and contrite. Lord, wash away my iniquity and cleanse me from my sin. Pray, my sisters and brothers, that our sacrifice may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands, hands for the praise and glory of God's name, for our good, good and for good the good of all God's people. Lord, each year we recall the glory of your apostle Simon and Jude. Accept our gifts and prepare us to celebrate these holy mysteries. We ask this in the name of Jesus the Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And also, also with, with you. you. Lift up your heart. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right to give God thanks Thank and praise. praise. Father, all powerful and ever living God, we do well always and everywhere to give you thanks. You are the eternal shepherd who never leaves his flock untended. Through the apostles, you watch over us and protect us always. You made them shepherds of the flock to share in the work of your son. And from their place in heaven, they guide us still. And so with all the choirs of angels in heaven, we proclaim your glory and join in their unending hymn of praise. Holy, 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 holy. God, God, God of power and might. Heaven and earth are filled with your glory. Hosanna in the highest. highest. Blessed, Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the, in the highest. Lord, you are holy indeed, the fountain of all holiness. Let your spirit come upon these gifts to make them holy, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. Before he was given up to death, a death he freely accepted, he took bread and gave you thanks. He broke the bread gave it to his disciples and said, take this, all of you, and eat it. This is my body, which will be given up for you. When supper was ended, he took the cup. Again, he gave you thanks and praise gave the cup to his disciples and said, take this, all of you, and drink from it. This is the cup of my blood, the blood of the new and everlasting covenant. It will be shed for you and for all, so that sins may be forgiven. Do this in memory of me. Let us proclaim the mystery of faith. Christ, Christ has, has died. died. Christ, Christ is, is risen. risen. Christ, Christ will, will come, come again. again. In memory of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Father, this life-giving bread, this saving cup. We thank you for counting us worthy to stand in your presence and serve you. May all of us who share in the body and blood of Christ be brought together in unity by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church throughout the world. Make us grow in love together with Anthony, our presiding bishop, Francisco and Anthony, our bishop, and all the clergy. Remember our brothers and sisters who have gone to their rest in the hope of rising again. Bring them and all the departed into the light of your presence. 
have mercy on us all. Make us worthy to share eternal life with Mary, the Virgin Mother of God, with the apostles and with all the saints who have done your will throughout the ages. May we praise you in union with them and give you glory through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, with him, in him, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours, Almighty Father, forever and ever. Amen. Amen. And now, as our Savior Christ has taught us, we are bold to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be, be your name. name. Thy kingdom, thy kingdom come, come, thy will, will, will be done. done. On earth, earth as, as it is in heaven. Give us this day, day our daily bread. And forgive, and forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive, we forgive those, those who trespass, who trespass against, against us. And lead us and not into temptation, temptation, but deliver us, from, us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, from every evil. And grant us peace in our day. In your mercy, keep us free from sin. And protect us from all anxiety as we wait in joyful hope for the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, for the, kingdom the power, the power and the glory are yours now, now and forever. And forever. Amen. Amen. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy, mercy on us. Lamb of God, Christ. you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. May this mingling of the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ bring eternal life to us who receive. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of the living God, by the will of the Father and the work of the Holy Spirit, your death brought life to me. By your holy body and blood, free me from all my sins and from every evil. Keep me faithful to your teaching and never let me be part of This is the Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Happy are those who were called to his supper. Lord, I am not worthy, not worthy to receive you, but only say, say the word, word and I shall be you. May the body of Christ bring me to everlasting. Amen. May the blood of Christ bring me to everlasting. Lord Jesus, we believe that you are present in this most blessed sacrament. We love you above all things and desire to receive you into our soul. For all those persons in this moment who may not be able to receive this sacrament, let them now receive you spiritually into their heart. We embrace you and unite ourselves to you completely. Never permit us to be separated from you. Amen. Amen. Let us pray. Father, in your spirit we pray, may the sacrament we receive today keep us in your loving care. As we honor the death of St. Simon and Jude, we ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. And also with you. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Our Mass is ended. Go in peace to love and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God.